If you know these three isomers, you can figure out every isomer. An isomer is a molecule with the same molecular formula, but a different chemical structure. So for example, if you look at pentanthione with a molecular formula of C5H10O, an isomer is any different arrangement of these 16 atoms to make a different molecule. And you can do that in three ways. The first way is by making a chain isomer, typically done by rearranging the chain to have a different length. So 3-methylbutantuone has moved this CH3 to where this H was and swapped their places, meaning you still have the same exact formula, C5H10O, but it's a new molecule chemical. The second way that you can do this is by making a position isomer, which is where you move the functional group or substituent if you have one to somewhere else on the chain. That's why pentan 2 own is a position isomer since the ketone is on a different position on the molecule. The last type of isomer is a function group isomer which is where you have the same molecular formula but you've rearranged the atoms in some way that you've created a new functional group. So when we move the carbonyl to the end of the chain we create an aldehyde which is of course a different function group to a ketone. Hence pentanal is the function group isomer of pentan 3 -ohm. So if that made sense comment down below some other groups that can form function group isomers with each other and make sure you're following us at Catalyst Chemistry HSC to start crushing chemistry today. See you in the next one.